Hello everyone and welcome to the highlights of round 20 of the Gallagher Premiership season, a round that was dominated by the almighty scrap to join Exeter, who'd already qualified for the playoffs in those semi-finals. 94 points in the afternoon. But Lee Blackett will be the happiest of the two coaches. The momentum certainly building for Wasps, for whom it's been quite an eight days. Saracens, Leicester, and now Bristol have been dispatched in grand fashion. A ninth win in their last 10 league matches. Never really felt like it was in the balance, if we're honest. The scoreline rather flatters the Northampton Saints, even though they're the ones who scored three tries in the final analysis. But Leicester have beaten Northampton for the first time in almost two years, and they have their second win after the resumption of the Gallagher Premiership. And it saw a first half with just two tries and a second half with eight. Worcester Warriors will take the win and the bonus point, but London Irish will get the fourth try bonus point of their own. It is its own little battle going on at the bottom of the table with a view towards next season, given that that starts in only 10 weeks time. It has finished at the temporary home of London Irish here at the Stoop. London Irish 25, Worcester Warriors 40. Get off the field. Four consecutive away matches for the first time in 10 years for those Bath boys. And they win at the AJ Bell for the first time since 2014. A maximum return, a maximum haul for the visitors. For the Sharks, only their third loss here in the league this season. New names in famous shirts and a win for Saracens and their young hopefuls. But both, certainly for the first hour, offering plenty to keep us entertained. Saracens have ended the Chiefs' winning streak post-lockdown by 40 points to 70. Effective work from Quinns tonight. Very efficient, you have to say, from Paul Gustard's men. They've been feeding off scraps for much of the match, but they have taken their opportunities really, really well. And they are deserved winners this evening. By 28 points to 15, and they've secured a top eight finish in the Premiership, which should lead to Champions Cup rugby next season. Full time at King's Home, Gloucester 15. Harlequins 28. So with two rounds to go and despite defeat here at Allianz Park, with Wasp beating Bristol, Exeter's home semi-final, which was looking at dead cert anyway, is now rubber stamped. But beneath the leaders, the battle to join them in the playoffs and get the other home semi-final has become even tighter with just two points between Wasps in second and Bristol now down in fifth. And remember, it's the top eight that qualify for the Champions Cup next season.